after Emma. Oh, great. And it was very bizarre on the last day. I mean, we, it was really emotional. We just kind of came in and, and did a day's work, and then it sort of it all ended. It was very strange the last day. Was... Hey, Jack. So it's just a final big leap. Yeah. Oh one last leap. <laughs> one last leap. Fine. One last leap. Fine. I wasn't really looking forward to it that much in the sense that it was the last day. We already felt it was going to be difficult and awkward. This is such an ironic way to... I know. It's a very strange last yeah. shot. I know. And the morning itself was quite tense. And I just felt the best way to deal with it was get through it as quickly as possible and not labour and not do loads of takes and just get to the moment where we could say, that's a wrap. And cut. And check the okay. But I feel like I've blocked out the memory because it's almost it was almost like too much. Could I just ask everyone just to uh, join us over by the monitor over there to my right in that open area? If everyone could just head over there, please. That'd be great. It didn't quite feel real, and it, it was a bit it was a bit traumatic. really imagine life without this yet because as literally I've been I'm filming longer than I haven't been filming. First day of principal oh, photography okay. only 247 to go. You know I don't think in, in film television history there can anything quite like it where we've all grown up with this these characters and with each other. This is our second home, basically. It's going to be sad to say goodbye to this place, for one. More importantly, yeah, the people that, that, that dwell within it. We're like a family, a fairly functional family at that. It's been an incredible journey. We take what we do very seriously, but we have a lot of fun doing it. And then... You're all right, what? It's true. You're OK? Yeah, not you. Yeah. Gonna miss kind of playing around. <laughs> and yeah, I think we've kind of over the years we've kind of blended into one kind of person. I feel like there are so few roles out there that have smart women in them, smart girls, and I feel very privileged to have played Hermione, definitely. It is like you miss a friend or something. And um, so, you know, there's, there's stuff I got to do in this part which, which I loved and, and will probably never have a chance to do again. Like it will ever be over, and it, it'll always be, I don't know, part of who I am, and it'll always just, it'll always be a part of my life. This has been my life, and so it's gonna be very, very odd, I think, for all of us, um, because I don't know what my day to day life consists of without you, all of you, and it's wonderful, and I just want to say that um, I've loved every minute, and thank you all very, very much because you made last time. <laughs> Thank you.